everybody and welcome back to another episode how is everybody doing man i'm doing so good i can't believe we're in episode 91 we're so close to episode 100 the world tour the download i've never ever 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 made it to 100 episodes in any series so we are breaking records when we get to that 100 and we're gonna do something very 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 special for that episode just get ready it's gonna be awesome but we got some work to do before we get there i want to finish off this village before episode 100 and i think we can do it we don't have a lot left i think we can totally do it and then also uh today i'm just gonna let you know right now today's gonna be an awesome episode because i'm gonna do my best to finish this part of the village by adding a brand new marketplace right behind us i'm gonna do some diagonal market stalls let's see how that turns out and then also i'm gonna finish up this little house behind us here uh and look at that we made a new one back here <laughs> this is some off cam cam just playing around making some stuff and i like the way that one came out they came out so nice uh, another thing we got to add to this area is a nice little uh gatehouse right here on this side and we're probably gonna end up doing that uh the little camp over there in the back right there we're gonna do a nice little mining entrance in the back there which is gonna be super super fun and i've been adding a bunch of you guys like crazy so if you did see in the comment section that i responded to you guys and i put hey you're in you're in, so don't even worry about it. We're gonna find you eventually. If anything, if you do the world download episode 100, you're gonna see yourself walking around in this village. So it's super, super fun and super awesome. So if I haven't added you yet, just put hashtag, put me in your world. I'm gonna see if I can add more before the next episode. I'm gonna add as many as you guys as possible, but guess what we're doing today as well? You know what? It's time. It's time to finally do some trades. So I went back to our Oblivious City, our main area, and I collected some stuff in this beautiful little shulker box. It's a bunch of items for trade. So you know what? Before we start building stuff, let's go find the best possible villagers in this world. And maybe it's one of you guys. Let's see. Hold on. Let's find some good trades to do some stuff with. All right. Let's see who we got over here. Atlas, what's up? What do you got? 24 paper. For an emerald, that is not bad. Let's remember, 24 for a, uh, for emerald. So basically, these are the materials I brought. Uh, so I got paper. So I know we're going to be taking advantage of those paper trades. I got wool. So we're going to take advantage of those wool trades with the shepherds. I got some coal. Who's the coal person? I forgot. And I got some rotten flesh for the clerics. And I got leather for the leather workers. We could get a bunch of emeralds with this stuff right here. Uh, we have a bunch more stuff back home. But I just brought a little bit of a taste test. What's up, Tesseract? We got Tesseract here. We got, who's this? Sa the Saus Baus. The Baus of Saus. Uh, <laughs> what's up? Um, I didn't have any stuff to trade for the farmers. So we can go back and get some farming stuff. Who are you? Ooh, I forgot my I forgot string. Jay, la, 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 la. I forgot the string. Well, ooh, whole milk boy. What you got? Ooh, coal. Did I bring any coal? I brought coal. What, what's your trade again? 15. Ooh, that's not bad. 15 might be pretty good. Okay, so far it's 24 paper for that. And whole milk boy with the uh, the 15. You got 10. Sorry. You are my best friend. Joker's my best friend. I don't think you could get better than 10. I literally do not think you could get one. Well, Palin. I don't think you could get better than 10. I think that's it. Joker, come with me, my friend. Joker is my boy. Joker, I love you so much. Now, get me, come back, Joker. Uh, let me see. This is the first time we're doing trades here. Shut your mouth back there. Um, oh, my God. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Go from novice to your next step, baby. Go to your next step. What is your next? Where's your little button? You, oh, look, 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 look. He's farting. Oh, Joker, you farting. That's gross, man, but I appreciate you. Joker, where you at? Now I can tell where Joker's at because I can see the smart the, the smart bubbles. The fart bubbles. Oh my god, everyone's around him too. Oh, and I put the bell there for now. Uh, Joker, where you at? I lost you with all the fart bubbles. The fart bubbles are gone. Joker, where did you go, my friend? Oh, he gone. Are you? Where did you go? I lost him? It's too many people here. It's too many people. Atlas, wh where did Joker go? Joker? Jo oh man, it's over. I lost him. He totally did some kind of Jason Bourne thing. Oh no, there you are. Come back. Uh, he is now an apprentice. Where is your little name tag thing that shows that you went up a level? I would love to see it. Come here, Joker. Get out of the way, everybody. I need to see Joker's new pin. Is that it right there? Oh, I don't know if he has it because we're germs of boys packet. I think it might have modified it. Either that or um, I just don't see where his pin is at. Where's your pin, boy? Don't you have a little uh, different color pin or something? Is that it? It looks like a piece of fish or something there. Okay, hold on. Let's give it, give it some more. Is that it? Oh, I think that's it. He locked it. The trade is locked. 
Yep, okay, it's locked for now. That's fine. Thank you for all the emeralds. These are the ones that I have here, and I can buy other stuff from you. But you're beautiful. You're a sweet boy. All right, let's see who else has what. Uh, wait, where's my shulker box? Give me this shulker box right now. Um, all right, where, where's everybody else at? Charlie, what you got? Oh, I don't want any of that. What books you got? I don't even want that. 24 paper. Okay, that's equal to the other one we saw. You know what? Let's go to the old school friends who are on the other side. So many iron golems. I'm going to have to find another way. Bubbles, come with me, girl. There's too many iron golems here. You might get stepped on. Come, come, come. <laughs> we got to get her out of there. All right, now, we're definitely going to be making that in very, very soon. But for now, we're going to see what's happening. Jake, what you got? Uh, I don't want any of, the, uh, any of that. Any of that. Um, Those are all right. What you got? Curse of Binding. Jerrica, that is horrible. I don't even want any of that. Silk touch, silk touch. Oh, baby. Um, let's see what else. Quick charge, all right. Uh, I don't want any of that. Oh, you know what? I got to show you something. Something's been happening over there in that tower. Uh, I kind of left. Um, I, 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 let, I let it go. I haven't been back there in a very long time. And I saw a bunch of people snuck up to the rooftop part uh well to the top floor up those ladders and there is a big group of amazing people over there and now you guys just gotta see it is it bedtime already bubbles is bedtime just hang over here this is safe back here you won't get run over by any golems uh but hold on let me make it daytime let me see if i can steal one of these beds and i'll be right back and i'll show you what special things are in that tower? All right, check this out. This tower right here is holding a bunch of awesome librarians. Uh, and I got to show you. And it's really cool because a lot of them have been going straight up to this area. And it's so funny. Uh, they're kind of trapped right here right now. Um, so uh, right here we have two. Uh, Leanna, uh, what's going on? What do you got? So Leanna got Power 5. Isn't that an amazing book? This one is Fortune 3. So cool. Uh, and let's jump up here and let me show you the rest of these guys. So on this one, we have uh, Looting 3. What is going on with you? That was really weird. Uh, we have a, a horrible one here. This one's like overpriced. I don't know what's wrong with you. I don't know what's wrong with you, Alberto. Uh, over here, we got a Smite 2. This is the only one that I was like, eh, whatever. Um, there, Feather Fallen 4. Uh, we have who else? Oh, th there we go. Oh, this one. This, this is a decent paper trade um, And whatever paper trade. So what I've been doing is I've been trying to re-roll these and the thing is it's so cool All you gotta do is go right here to the edge. Let's see. This is who's this you got the smite too I don't like the smite too. So all I gotta do is gotta get rid of that Make sure they turn back into a nitwit plop that back on and see what they do. Hello You want to come back here for a second? There we go. And let's see what they got. Please be mending Oh, no mending. Um, so I've been trying to get mending for a while. I haven't been lucky. So maybe if we try it a couple times here, we can get lucky. Come on, mending. Man, punch one. I don't want to punch one. Uh, so yeah, we, we don't have to do this right now. So I'm going to keep doing this off candy cam. Eventually, we'll get... Oh, that's not bad, but I, I don't have a trident, so it doesn't matter. Uh, eventually, we'll get mending, like right now. Oh, come on. Let's do it. What well, people are, are watching. People are watching right now, back home. Respirate. I don't want to respirate. Okay, one more. Let's just do it three more times. One. Oh, baby! Oh, baby! Okay, you know what? The YouTube guys have shined a light upon us, baby. Third and fall for a mini book. I would totally give you all this, and you would give me a mini book. Is that is that how this works right now? Oh, no. I, mm, no, no, I'm not going to waste it yet. But we have a mending trader. I love you. Oh, look at this. I don't want... I want that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want that. Ooh. Oh, okay. Down below, put hashtag mending. And I'm going to pick one of you to be my mending villager. The most amazing villager in the history of the world. Right here. This could be you. Let me know. Who is going to be the special mending villager? So super cool. I love that. Thank you so much, my sweet friend. That's awesome. Uh, maybe we can even get the price down if we trade paper. Uh, but we can't trade paper with him. Who's our paper boy? 26. No, I don't like you. 25. Ooh. 25. 24. Okay, you know what? Let's trace the paper with this boy right here. Um, bum, bum, bum. And maybe they will lower all the price. Oh, God. Ooh, you're putting that right up in my face. Um, is it you? 24? Okay, here we go. Let's do a little bit of paper trade. Maybe they see it and they're like, ooh, this guy's super nice. He's trading with my friends. Maybe I'll lower the price and I'll trade with him even better. Ooh, baby. Let's go. Give me all your emeralds, sweet friend of mine. That's it? You're done? Is that it? No more? Oh, no. We got more. There we go. There we go. There. Hold on. Put all that up there. Put all that up there. There we go. Oh, you're no longer a novice. You are an apprentice. Oh, baby. And then it locks it until the next day or in a couple hours from now. Oh, there comes the fart bubbles again. Oh, man. Jay Salaruyu. 
Oh, and we open up more stuff. Infinity, not bad. We open up trades now, baby. We locked that one, though, but we could do the other ones. That is super cool. I don't want any bookshelves at the moment. I got a good amount of emeralds, though. Isn't that awesome? And where's your little badge? I want to know what the badge is. I don't know if Germ has it. Is this, is this the, the default one or the Germ change it up? Because I don't see no little bands. I'm going to talk to my boy Germ. Uh, but we got our mending Fred. Is this you? Never change. Never change. <laughs> Wasn't that like the luckiest thing ever? That is so awesome. So we finally have a mending trader. Oh, it's so good. And I don't know what's happening over here. These people are just getting stuck in there, but I'm not letting them out. That's fine. Uh, but <laughs> doing so good. You know what? Let's go to the leather workers now. See if anybody has a good leather tray. Oh, a seven. Why? Why are you so expensive? Seven. What do you got? Six. Ooh. Come here, my friend. And who are you? You don't have a name yet. Um, let's get some leather. Let's do some leather trading. Because I want some of those emeralds. Come on, my friend. Give me. Give me. Give me. Oh, man. This is going to be amazing. Look at all these. We're swimming in emeralds. Thank you. And it's time. What's up, Zoy? What do you trade, Zoy? Zoy has a good paper. Uh, I mean, leather trade. My friend Zoy. No, I want that one. Thank you. My friend Zoy XP, everybody. Subscribe to Zoy. Take it over the world. Truly bad rock. The guy who actually uh, made my beautiful uh, sausage face. And also, if you go to my main page, you're going to see my, uh, my my banner, my YouTube banner. Zoy made that because it's Zoy. It's an artiste. And also, the Lord of the Undead. And also has great trades. Very nice trades, Zoy. Uh, come here. Give me one more. Zoy is now an apprentice. Where's your little fart bubbles, Zoy? Oh, they're the fart, the, the, the fart bubbles from Zoy. Those smell a little more, a little more wretched because he is an, an undead master. Zoy, what do you got now? Pink booties. Why am I not surprised? Uh, that's so awesome. All right, cool. Lovely paper trades. I mean, leather trades. With the lovely leather trades, lovely uh, paper trades. Who are you? Oh, that's my boy Nova right there. We're naming a bunch of these characters as superheroes from Marvel. So we got Thor. We got Nova. We got Goose up in the front over there. Uh, I can't find the cute one from the last episode with the two multicolored eyes. No idea where I put him. We'll find him eventually. <laughs> so awesome. That has been so much fun. That was so awesome trading with these guys, man. Oh, we're at 32 Rotten Flesh. Let's do one more. 32, I think it's the, the standard, right? 32. 24 paper, eh? What you got? Whoa, ooh, 18 wool. That is not bad, actually. What you got? What you got? 44 paper, eh? What you got? Unbreak it? I don't like that, Cam Caden. But it's okay. I believe in you. Uh, what do you got here? Uh, 10, no. Oh, man. So so many awesome trades around here. Uh, what do you got? 10, okay. What you got? Nothing. Nothing of importance. What do you got? Uh, whatever. Okay. You know what? I'll do some more trading off Cam. This has been so much fun. We got some very, very cool trades happening. But let's go do some building. And uh, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna make this place look even better so we can trade even more in style. Check these market stalls out. I love it. I love it. We got diagonals. We got little stalls. So I decided to go with something small. Uh, I think at the beginning, I really was thinking about something even bigger, but we don't have a lot of space here. So if I do them like this at a diagonal uh, and have a little trap door, you can close it up and get in like that. Oh, it makes it look so good. And we don't need them that big, right? Now, back here, we have a little way in on this side as well. Looking very cool. So it's so nice and little. So we got them all in diagonal. So I'm going to build one right now with you guys. And you know what? What is yeah, yeah. Wait. Hello? Jelly? Is that jelly? Finally, do we have fish? We have, of course, we have fish. Give me our lanterns. Ooh, and I was about to say, nighttime is the best time for building, but also, nighttime is the best time to find jelly. Is that jelly? Give me right now. Hold on, hold on. It's very dangerous out here too. Gel? Is that you, jelly, jelly? Oh, hello, hello, hello. Can, can you please stop? Thank you. Um, let's see if we can. Scaffold this way. Um, I guess I guess you can. Hold on. Jelly, is that you? Is that you? Hold on. Shh, shh. Oh, guys, guys, you gotta tell me yes or no. Put hashtag jelly yes or hashtag jelly no. Is this finally jelly? Is that you? Don't you dare kill jelly. Oh no. Um. Please, not at this moment. Not at this moment. I think I found my, my my friend Joe. I think I found my friend Jelly. Skeleton, I will deal with you later. Jelly, is this you? I think they had the gray little outlines like that. Where did Jelly go? If that's Jelly, I don't know. Jelly, did you go this way? 
Oh, come on now. Come on. <gasps> no, that's string. Okay. I lost her. I lost Jolly. No. Oh, hello. Excuse me. Thank you for dying. Jolly, where did you go? Oh, my God. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Not this time. Not this time. Jelly, please. Don't run. Jelly gone. Was that Jelly? Somebody let me know down below. I am not even playing with you. I'm not playing with you. I'm not doing anything but playing with you. Let's go. You know what? This is, this is, this means war. Oh, no. Help. 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 I'm fine. I don't need any help. That's fine. I'm okay. Hello, Skeleton. Um, I think we scared Jelly off. There's too much violence, but let me know down below. Was that Jelly? All right, I don't know if that was Jelly or not, but Jelly gone. <laughs> so let's build this real fast so you guys can see what style we're going with and how we set this up. And I, man, you know what? I always got fish on me just in case. Get out of here, spider eye. Uh, but let me show you how I build this thing. So if you notice, these are similar, but a little different. Uh, so some of these have, um, like down below, this will be our spruce variant. This will be the one with the dark oak. We have some stripped as well. Stop kicking up all that dirt. Um, but <laughs> let's do this one with uh, with oak plank. So I'm gonna go right here at this edge, right about. So we got a little space gap right there. So we're just gonna go boom right here. So one, two, three. Then we're gonna go one back. Let's do a little stripped and a little stripped, just like that. Maybe strip. This? No, this is gonna be a uh, trap door to get in. So we're gonna do trap. That's not even a trap. Where's my trap? Get out of here. Trap goes. Yeah, perfect. And then we're gonna get rid of you. Perfect, so that's looking good. Maybe this one could be a strip as well. Yeah, and then plank right there, perfect. Then let's go ahead and grab some walls. I'm gonna put a wall here, a wall here. We're gonna put, let's put different walls. We got two different variants. We got the cobble and we got the smooth stone or the, uh, the stone, regular stone. Oh, the sun's going up. No, the village is gonna wake up and bother me. It's fine. So for this, <laughs> we're gonna go right here in the front with a fence and a fence right here and right here. Then we're gonna go with slabs. So slabs are gonna go here, up uh, there. I'm gonna go with slab right there. No, there we go. Get rid of this piece. Let's take this out of the way. Uh, and let's put trap doors back in. Let's grab some of this as well. Oh, no. <laughs> let's do a little bit of scaffolding. Uh, let's put this in our other hand and go up a little higher just so we get a good vantage point of this. Perfect. Then from here, we're gonna start going down. Not like that, like this. So this is gonna go down right about here. Placeholder block, I'm gonna drop that in here. Come over here as well, placeholder block, drop this in just like that. We're gonna bring this around like so, just like that. This comes out right here. We're gonna drop this in as well. Drop that in here as well. Bring this up and around just like so. And then we're gonna close this off actually back here as also. And we're almost there. Let's jump up to the top. Let's tweak this a little bit. So that's gonna go right here at that part. That's looking cool. And then if you see that, we're putting trap doors right on the tippy top. Let's go right about here. Let's actually, you know what? Let's make this one a little bit different. What if we go, uh, let's see. Let's take this one out. Let's put a little slab right there. I think this looks even cooler. Let's make different variants because this one you see here has that style. This will have this style, which looks very, very cool as well. And then this one will have a little bit of a different variant, which looks very, very cool. I like that. Actually, that looks pretty good. And maybe down here, we can put a couple more trap doors just to make it a little different each time. Oh, that looks nice. Let's get rid of you. Oh, that looks cool. I like that. And then we can put a little lantern on this piece right in here. And that looks beautiful. Uh, yeah, I think this looks really, really cool. We can, we can keep tweaking though, but I think that might look just right. Maybe let's take this little piece out. Let's, let's see what that looks like. Actually, that looks better taking that little bit out. Give me you. That looks cool. Give me you. Thank you. I think this looks awesome. Check that out. Oh, let's see. Let's take a step back. Oh, that looks so cool. I love this. This looks so nice. Now, the only thing we need to do is do a little terraform action on the bottom and make it look very natural, very cool. And maybe even add a couple walls here just to hold this part off and maybe put like extra little uh, bits back here. So let me go ahead and do that real fast. I'm gonna add little walls like this. I'm gonna put one on this side maybe. Uh, let's do a little bit of terraforming too. We're gonna come up here and do a little bit of path work. This one's gonna go up to that. That's gonna go up to there. This is gonna curve up to this side and people are gonna walk around this direction. And then we still have the space to do our little gatehouse back here on this side. 
Oh yeah, cool. Give me a second. Let's do a little more terraform action. See how we can set this up. Oh, baby, baby, baby. What do you guys think? Is it came out all right? I think it came out pretty cool. Check this out. So we have little ways in here. We got another little way in the back. We got it all decorated. The path is looking very, very cool. Nice and run down, trodden. Looks like everyone here is passing by. I uh, put the bell right here. So people are going to be coming any second now. We got some walls set up all the way around. So we're going to put a little gate right here. Remember, we're going to put a gate. And then this is kind of blocked in. So you, your line of sight just actually goes boom and turns in here it's like oh what's back here a little seating action oh man what are you doing back here take a look come around to the side and then you have your area here for shops now i need your help i need to know what kind of shops are we doing down here so we have three different stalls so do this hashtag market stall and let me know what should we sell in each of these for now i just put a bunch of just random blocks so uh i have a little cartography table here i put a load of grindstone here and then i put a fletching table right there so let me know what i should put what do we sell in each one of these three market stalls i'm gonna pick the three best on the next episode yo. but oh i love this market it looks so cool i can't wait but you know what give me one quick second i really need to go ahead and pick the comment of the day from the last episode if you do remember oh hi that's me. Uh, if you do remember last episode, I asked you guys, what is your first memory when you first played Minecraft since the 10th anniversary is right around the corner? I want to go ahead and pick out one of my favorite comments and also let you know when uh, I first played Minecraft and what my first memory was too. But give me a second. Let's get these stuff together. Let's go over it right now. Oh man, here we go. I got the comment of the day. This, there were so many good comments. If you guys want to check out last episode, there were so many cool stories from you guys. I read every single one. I appreciate every single one of them. This one just stood out to me because I could picture this happening like uh, for me. Like, uh, uh, Listen to this. Here we go. One, two, three. Boop. Uh, uh, ra art. Is that how you say it? Ra and then art. Ra art. Uh, either way, <laughs> Rart was saying, uh, I started playing Minecraft in 2014. My first memory was when I was playing Minecraft in my room on my phone and my mom was making really big cookies and I was caving and I was fighting mobs when my mom said, the cookies are ready. And I got killed by a skeleton. I was only 10 years old. So that was <laughs> that was awesome. So it's like, you're there in the background. You're playing some Minecraft. You smell those cookies. They're almost ready. Your mama's like, yo, cookies are done. Come on, come on here. Eat your cookies. And, and you know, you know, I, I wouldn't pay attention to anything else. I would have got killed by a skeleton too. <laughs> so that was super cool. I can picture it right now. that You just literally like got all excited for the cookies. And then all of a sudden you got super sad because you got killed by a skeleton. And th that's a great story. <laughs> but thank you all so much. And for real, so I suggest going back into episode 80, uh, no, 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 90? Episode 90, checking it out, reading all all those awesome reminiscent comments and that was super super cool now for me i'm gonna tell you how i got my minecraft so i got minecraft the second it got launched in uh xbox 360 so uh, you know what let's build a little bit of this house while we talk about it so i got it when the xbox 360 uh created their uh version from 4j studios baby 4j oh man uh I, back in the day i haven't even heard that word in so long 4j made recipes is it still going on are they still the ones developing the bedrock edition i don't know uh but oh man so many good memories uh, i got it on digital so i didn't even get it with a copy a literal copy uh i got it digitally so the second was a release i was just oh you know what i'm getting it and the cool thing is that i i, I was already uh watching a lot of minecraft videos at, at that time I think I was watching, who was I watching back in the day? I think I was watching Pro Syndicate. Uh, I was watching uh, the Yogg's cast. So those are the people I was watching at that time. So I knew about it. I just didn't have a good PC enough to run anything related to Minecraft. So I was waiting for it to come out on consoles. And the second it was released on consoles, I was there. Hold on, what was the date again? Let me see, I think I have it somewhere over here, hold on. All right, it took me forever, but I found the details. It was, it was a Mojang Studios in conjunction with 4J, launching on May 9th, 2012. So that is when I first got a copy digitally, not even a physical copy, I got a digital copy 
of Minecraft straight into my Xbox 360. Uh, that was a lot of fun. So I had an idea. I did see a lot of Let's Plays, so I knew how to play, sort of. But it was a little different because it still was console. So I did have the wiki open. I had all that ready to go. And I started just watching and, 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 and playing at the same time. And it was so much fun. I think the first build I ever built was like a beachside house. Literally, I built a house right on the beach with like a little dock. It wasn't anything crazy. It wasn't anything too uh, extravagant. It was very low key. Very low key. It kind of looked a little modern, to be honest. <laughs> it wasn't even, it had flat roofs. It didn't have any overhangs. It was really nothing to it. I wish I kept that world and I wish I had uh, a copy so you guys can see. I also built like almost like a little ravine uh, town. I would go down like a little, and I, you know, that reminds me, I should do a little ravine town in, uh, in this world somewhere. Uh, but it wasn't all the way ravine town. It was almost like a, um, like I would build like little houses almost on stilts kind of uh, going down a ravine going all the way to the bottom that was really really cool it was really it was really weird because it was like the chunk generation in those uh, in in the uh, 360 was a little bit awkward uh, and the world was an infinite so eventually got to the border ends and it, it was really weird because it was really close to a border end uh, and the ravine was kind of like split and there was like water halfway on the side there it was really awkward it was a very bad seed I didn't do seed hunting before I decided to play uh, but it was a very very fun experience I, I couldn't I, I, I would love to relive that again imagine you get some kind of new science fiction futuristic thing that you can actually uh, uh, relive memories and stuff like that and it was so much fun I remember my mama making some hot pockets uh, it was it was delicious it was the uh, the pepperoni pizza and the uh, Philly cheesesteak hot pockets in the background uh, while I was eating getting my controller all nasty full of full of gunk while I was playing uh, I got killed by a creeper on the second day. Uh, I, I, I hated birds from the start because it looked like a dried up old cow carcass. So I used to <laughs> use them um, as, uh, as sticks, as chests, as crafting benches. Even back then, my hatred. My hatred was strong for the birch, but I would still use it. Uh, so uh, that was like so much fun though. And uh, yeah, that was my first memories. Uh, and then later on I got, I, you know, my builds weren't that great, man. So uh, I have faith in you guys. You guys can totally make it. Uh, don't worry, uh, just keep at it. Keep at it, you get good eventually because it took me a while. It took me a while to get good. Uh, and, and right now I'm still learning every day. So the people I was learning from at the beginning was definitely my boy Corrales, uh, especially his first medieval house. That was like, I think it was in 2013, almost a year later I learned uh, how to get a little better. I was like, well, let's do how to build a house um, tutorials all over the place. And I learned a lot. B does back then. So many cool builds back then. Fire UK, I remember them uh, really big back in the day, doing these big epic builds. I was like, man, can you do that in Minecraft? That's crazy. Uh, let's learn a little bit. Let's see how we can get good at this at uh, this style. Uh, and that was uh, that was just the beginning. Uh, but man, what are you guys' first memories? Let me let me know uh, as far as like YouTube memories of who do you used to watch back in the day. Let me know also down below. That should be a question of the day for another episode. But you know what? I have some fun today. Let's ask a bunch of questions of the day. Uh, but you know what? Let's let me finish this house up. I'm just throwing blocks together so it looks pretty cool hopefully i can make it look pretty decent and uh, i'll be back in a little bit let's see what we can do with this and we'll probably close off the episode yo, at that point but look at this everyone's gathering around the market <laughs> so cool i love this this is coming out so awesome oh, all right give me a second we're almost done Oh man, check this out. This house came out pretty cool. I love this. We had a like, little tower in the back, a little bit of a walkway with some bush back here, a little broken area right there. I love that. Look at the tower. That's nice. A uh, little back window, a little more bush, overgrown. I, I want to break up a little bit more, but it's looking really, really cool. Add a little fireplace on this side. Let's check out the interior. The interior looks pretty nice. So we have double doors on opposite sides. We have uh, this lovely. Hi, Fisha. Uh, <laughs> we added some details here, a little bit of a kitchen blast furnace here uh, a couple extra beds more cartography tables uh, and then up here double bed a little bit of painting action and this is looking awesome <laughs> what do you think of that we're officially done with the actual builds in here the only thing we need to do is do a little tiny gatehouse here uh, and that'll probably be either the next one or uh, let me know if you guys want me to do that or we can go out there in the back finish off that uh outside area that we wanted to do with the um what is it a mine a bandit camp kind of thing or the inn we definitely need to do the inn i'm thinking inn i'm inspired for the inn uh but let me know what you guys think and is there anything else we need 
before we get out of here i still think we need to do something down below we still promised we were going to do something in the back behind the butchers and do something there uh so that'll be something really really awesome that we can set up uh and you know what we also have to do a path from here all the way back to oblivious and little by little i've been marking out some stuff i think we could spend some time working on terraforming path work let me know if that's something else that, that you might want to see i think it'll be pretty cool to show but i'm out of here for now thank you so much for watching everybody you guys have been amazing and i'll see you on the very next episode have a good one goodbye and yes these are iron golem carcasses right here he asked for it <laughs>